If someone asks me about the greatest blessings created by God, I would say it's women. Taking care of women, listening to them and respecting them is essential. No matter how much they might upset or provoke you, handling the situation in a kind and loving manner is crucial. It's said that a wise husband listens more to his wife's words and speaks less of his own. Today's video topic revolves around this and there's a clip from Jordan Peterson discussing how women feel, how they think and the reasons behind it. For those not subscribed to the channel, please do so and share your thoughts in the comments. I share my opinions based on my understanding, but knowing your thoughts sometimes changes my perspective. Let's proceed to watch the video and then discuss it. Women on average experience more negative emotion than men. So 75% really? of divorces are initiated by women and women are more unhappy than men. And so they're more prone to depression and they're more prone to anxiety disorders. They're more prone to suicide attempts, although men commit suicide more often because they use guns because men tend to be more violent even towards themselves. So women are higher negative emotion. And so why? Well, it kicks in at puberty. And so why would women become more sensitive to threat at puberty? Well, let's figure it out. It's pretty straightforward. They're at a physical disadvantage because boys and girls can wrestle and fight but men and women can't mm -hmm. so men are way stronger especially in the upper body and so women hit men more than the reverse mm -hmm. by a lot so you might say well are women or men more violent well if it's just blows struck women win but if it's blows that land yeah Women get comparatively weaker physically, so mm -hmm. the world's more dangerous. Then they're more vulnerable sexually. Then they have to take care of infants. So they're tilted towards more threat detection. And so that makes them maybe suboptimally happy when you think about them as individuals. Friends, that was a video. As Jordan Peterson mentioned, there's no doubt that women tend to harbor more negative emotions. They face numerous challenges and pressures. Especially in Asia where many women are housewives, there's a unique pressure on them. They are often responsible for managing entire households given the prevalent culture norms in Asia. As they carry out their duties, they sometimes make mistakes. Additionally, unmarried women face immense societal pressure to get married. For instance, even if a woman achieves significant success in business by the age of 30 or 40, society still pressurize her to get married and have children to be considered truly successful. The societal expectations create a specific image and pressure for women. Men also face pressures, but their nature is different from what women endure. Women often deeply ponder over minor details because they are concerned about their children's futures. Men, on the other hand, are usually more focused on how to earn money and support their family. I jestingly say, men are more concerned about where to place bets to earn money. The responsibilities of men and women differ, but I believe they are equal in essence. Life moves forward with both playing their unique roles. I would love to hear your thoughts on this. Take care of yourselves and for now, that's all. Take care.